Good evening, everybody. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you? Mm, I think so. Very good. <laughs> All right. Excellent. I'm glad to hear that. How was your weekend? Good. You had a good weekend? <laughs> so, so. So, so. A little tired. Yeah, because the the last uh, salary, uh, I was uh, working. Oh. I stayed working. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. What about the rest of you? How, uh, how was your weekend? How was your weekend, everybody? Catherine, how was your weekend? Nice, Miss. Oh, good, good, good. Did you do anything special? Uh, no. No, nothing special? No. Oh, okay, I see. All right. Okay. Okay, Catherine, would you do me a favor? Um, I, I see that you just have your first name and your last name. Can you change it so we have uh, your complete name? Uh, no, understand, Miss. Okay, I need your name to be complete because right now you just appear as Catherine Melendez. But I need sí, your complete cierto. name. Mm -hmm. If you could do me that. No sé si me lo puede cambiar usted o no. No se puede. O tengo que eh, volver a meterme. No, no. Usted mismo lo puede hacer. ¿Ya sabe cómo hacerlo? No. Ok. Bye. Eh, está en su computadora, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ok. Entonces, eh, sobre el cuadro donde aparece su, su imagen. Uh -huh. ve, ve usted su imagen, ¿verdad? Cambiar nombre, ¿verdad? Cambiar nombre, cabal, ah. exacto. Ok, exacto. Ya, ya lo cambio. Gracias. Gracias. Ok, también lo mismo con Brenda Díaz. Solo aparece así, como Brenda Díaz. Está bien, no hay problema. I'm sorry, teacher. It's ok, it's ok. Ya lo cambié. Uh -huh. okay. Change, teacher. Don't worry. Ok, wonderful. Ah... Uh, Y los demás, no sé si están ahí porque no los veo. ¿Será posible que puedan encender su camarita? Sería excelente. Ok. Mis, una pregunta. Fíjese que en el ejercicio 3.4, uh -huh. solo el primero no me da, no sé por qué. En el ejercicio 3.4 de ya la plataforma de inglés. Ok. Eh, what's the problem? Fíjese de que vaya, me dice, I am not crazy about French food, pero no sé cuál ponerle si no I can do o eso. ¿Cuál ponerle? Porque dice, I am not crazy about French food. Mm -hmm. Pero no sé cuál es la que se tiene que poner porque ya le puse y no hallo, pues. Porque mm -hmm. vaya, está. I am angry, I am too. So I am. I do too, so do I. I can too, so can I pero no me da ninguna de esas. Y ya también ya lo intenté con el negativo y tampoco no me da. O sea, lo que me está diciendo es de que no le funciona la respuesta. Exacto. Eso es lo que me, eso es lo que me está sí. diciendo. Sí, que ya lo puse varias veces y no me da. Solo la primera no da. No sé por qué. Eh... ¿Qué le pone? 
Esa es la que le estaba diciendo. ¿Otra vez nuevamente? A ver, espere, ya le digo. I am too, so I am. I do too, so do I. I can too, so can I. Sí. Lo que sucede, lo, lo que sucede, Katherine, es que como todavía no hemos tenido esa clase, entonces, oh. eh, por eso es de que todavía no, no identifica cómo responder esa pregunta. Uh -huh. Pero eh, no se preocupe que cuando ya tengamos la clase, va a ser clarísimo. Ok, está bien. Ok. Gracias, amigos. Ah, ok. Eh, porque sí, tiene una respuesta y la respuesta ya revisé que la respuesta está correcta. Pero oh. el problema es eso. El problema uh -huh. es de que como todavía no hemos tenido la clase, entonces eh, sí, se, es, es un poco confuso, ¿verdad? Obviamente. Uh -huh. Ajá, pero ya después le va, va, va a ser ah, así como, ah, esa era la respuesta. Así que no se preocupe. Ok. okay. Okay, teacher, watching my name, please. Yes, your name is complete now. Thank you. Um, okay, all right, guys. Okay, um, we are going to start the class, everybody. Is it okay? Please tell me if you see. My my power my my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Um. Just a moment. Okay, um, so these are common health complaints. That what, that what this means is that these are um, complaints or problems that people have uh, for their health, but these are like um, not, not things you have to go to the, to the hospital or things like that. It's not very serious, but they are problems that people have about their health. So let's talk about the first one. We have a a headache. Can you repeat? A headache. A headache. A headache. Again? A headache. Okay. A headache. Mm -hmm. A headache. Very good. Please do not pronounce it headache. Headache. No, 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 no. Headache. It's headache. 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 Okay, I'm going to. I'm going, I'm going to send you. <clears throat> excuse me. I'm going to send you in the WhatsApp. Sorry, no, no WhatsApp. In the in the chat, I will send you how to pronounce it. Only like the pronunciation. Okay. So here we go. Headache. Do you see that? Do you see in the chat? Yes. Yes. Okay. So that's like the pronunciation. That's the correct pronunciation. So everybody repeat. Yeah. Headache. 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 Oh. Exactly. Headache. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay. Good, good, good. Then we have backache. Okay. Backache. 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 Yes, very good. Backache. It's the same Backache. idea. It's the same idea. Backache. So I, I will send you over there. It, 
in the chat, I sent you the the pronunciation. So it's back ache. Do not pronounce it H. Back H. No, it's ache. Back ache. Back ache. Back ache. Back ache. Back ache. Okay. Back ache. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's when your back, your back hurts. Uh, like that. Okay, that's a backache. Then we have a uh, sore muscles, sore muscles. So it means sore muscles. like sore all of your body, yeah, all of your body hurts. Sore that's muscles. a sore muscle. Uh, okay. Sore muscle. Sore muscle. Sore Good. muscles. Good. Sore muscles. This is this word here is muscles. Not muscles. muscles. Muscles, no. Muscles. <laughs> muscles. 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 Mm -hmm. muscles. Sure, muscles. muscles. Good. Okay. Next. Next, we have stomach ache. Stomach ache. Uh, stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Good. Okay, so stomach ache, again, we do not, again, we do not pronounce the, the it's not stomach, shh. stomach, no, it's stomach, and I'll write it in the chat, this pronunciation, stomach ache, stomach ache, stomach ache, so it's like pronounced like this, stomach ache, stomach ache. No, stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Mm -hmm. That's the pronunciation. Okay. Yeah. Stomach All ache. right. Stomach ache. And then mm -hmm. we have a cold. So, so a stomach cold, ache is when your when your when your stomach hurts, right? You're like, oh, your stomach. Okay. Then we have a cold. 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 Mm -hmm. In this moment, I see a cold. A cold. Mm -hmm. You have a cold in this moment? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Ada. That sucks. Yeah. But if if you if you if you take some um, medicine, maybe you get better very soon. So like uh, you can Thank take, you. yeah, maybe like um like vitamin C, you can drink, you, you can take vitamin C or drink a lot of lemonade. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Then we have a cough. A cough. A cough. 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 A cough. A cough. A cough. You pronounce it like this. Cough. 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 Actually, mm, no. Let me eliminate that. Cough. No, it's actually more like this. Yeah, this is more like it. Cough. 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 Oh. Yes. Yeah. So cough is. Yeah. So. Yeah. So cough is. <laughs> that's a cough. Mm -hmm. I have a cough. A cough. Mm hmm. Yeah. Exactly. Then we have the flu. The flu. The flu. The flu. The flu. The flu. Blue. 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 Mm -hmm. Good. The flu Good. is okay. Blue. The flu is short for influenza. Okay. So the flu. Really? Is, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Yeah, so it, it it means when you have a virus, a virus, or most of the time it's a virus. Sometimes because it can be a bacteria, but most of the time it's a virus. 
it's different from a cold. A cold is like, um, well, how do you say cold in Spanish? Resfriado. Resfriado. And the flu? Uh, I think so is, is gripe. Gripe. But uh, exactly. you, you say, you told, you told me it's uh, influenza. Is the same? Yeah, es que en realidad la una gripe es, es causada por la influenza. Oh. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, so, yeah, we can say, um, so the flu is, is the, the, the virus. The virus is the influenza. Sometimes it can be a bacteria, but most of the time it's influenza. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. And then we have insomnia. Insomnia. Mm -hmm. insomnia. Insomnia. Yes, very good. Insomnia. insomnia. And I think you understand insomnia because it's the same in Spanish, right? Yeah, it means you cannot sleep. Okay. Now, um, okay, so I have a question. Which of these health problems have you had recently? Don't 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 tell me. Don't tell me. Just write it down. Recently, which of these problems have you had? Okay, write write it in the in 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 your notebook. Which of these problems have you had? Okay. Are you finished? Or I you, got it. Do you need more time? Already. Already. It's fine. Done. No. Okay. Yes. Good. 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 All right. Now, um, then we have. Then I'm gonna ask you, what do you do? when you have these problems. So the problems that you wrote down, what do you do when you have, for example, if you, if recently you have a, a cough, what do you do for the cough? Uh, no, 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 don't, don't tell me, don't tell me. Just think okay. about it, just think. Okay. Okay, what do you do? What what solution do you have? Okay. Right, teacher? Write it down, yes. Right now? Right now, yeah. Right now. Okay. Yes. Write it down. Okay, are you finished? Done, teacher. Yeah? Okay, good. Ready. What I want you to do, we're gonna put you into breakout rooms and you're going to tell your partner or your group, better said, about these health complaints. So which health complaints have you had 
recently? And what do you normally do when you have those health problems? Okay, so do we understand what to do? Yes, I got it. Yeah, okay. All right, yes. good. Um, so, solo quiero asegurarme que todos los que estén acá van a participar. Oscar, can you participate? Uh, levantamos la mano, teacher. Uh, up the hands. Yes, uh -huh. Maybe, yeah, that, that would work. So, uh, raise your hand if you're going to be participating. Entonces, eh, Alicia Pérez, Eugenio, eh, Oscar Alexander, Catherine, Marielo, Jacqueline, Vanessa, Norma, Lisette, Noé, Ezequiel y Catherine Andreina no van a participar. No. Ok, um, bye. Eh, necesito, uh, creo que Alicia puso su mano, pero eh, en vez de poner, levantar la mano, Alicia, ¿usted, usted, ¿usted iba a participar o no? Alicia Pérez. Hola, teacher. Hola. ¿Usted va a participar? Dice que ahorita no puedo participar. Ok, ok, no hay problema. Es que había puesto como el dedito así como de, de, que, de que sí, ¿verdad? Entonces, por eso preguntaba. Ok. Um, ok, just give me a moment. Just, no, no, no me bajen la mano. Ahorita estoy. Estoy moviendo todas las personas que no van a participar. Disculpe, Miss, ¿qué es lo que teníamos que hacer? Levantar la mano. ¿O oh, de, de, de qué? ¿De, de qué me pregunta? La actividad, Miss. Oh, ok. Just give me a moment. Ya, ya les explico. Solo ahorita estoy moviendo a todas las personas porque sí son varios. Okay, I think I have everybody now. Okay, so what you, you're going to do simply is it's, um, tell your, your classmates what health problems have you had recently and what do you normally do um, to solve those problems, those health problems. Do you understand?
Do you understand or no? Hello? It's clear? Yes, teacher. For me, yes. Perfect. Okay. So I'm going to give you about four minutes to talk about it. Just say, um, you know, lately I've had this problem, this problem, this problem, this problem. I usually, for my headaches, I take um, a Tylenol, for example, or um, for my the flu, I drink vitamin C, I, I drink uh, lemonade, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. All right, here we go. We're opening the rooms. Hello, girls. Ana Marisela, Catherine, Felipe, Raquel. Hello. Hello. Bueno, van, van a hablar porque ya falta menos dos minutos. Yo le pedí un problema de situación de alguna enfermedad. No, 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 Chicas, necesitan empezar a hablar, necesitan conversar porque ya falta un minuto. Casi no se escucha, Catherine. No sé si puede subir. Eh, take a rest. Yes. Um, um, recently, I have a, um, a call. I, I think I need to, to take some vitamin C. I to drink a lot of liquids. I think I think that my my mom told me in other time you need to take um pa un, un tipo de pasto creo que le dicen lim limón no sé qué algo así lima no es un pasto es un monte ah, Thank you. Um, I yes. I... My my mom told me you need to, to drink that tea that this this de ese monte. Uh -huh. Are you really? I I I don't know. I think so is uh other other time because 
I am I, not, I am I am not an, animal. I'm so now in my, in my in in my in my list the 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 vitamins and um medicines. I don't know. <laughs> I need it in this moment. Sick. You, very good. Very really? Good. Yes. Uh, I have a goal. Yes, teacher. Uh, we we pronounce it vitamins. Oh, thanks, teacher. Vitamins. Yes, vitamins. Okay. Very good. Jennifer, what what do you tell me? I have a goal. Really? In this moment, you need a tea. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the tea uh, is delicious. Uh, for example, tea menta with manzanilla. How do you say manzanilla? I like manzanilla. <laughs> no sé cómo se dice miel. <laughs> it's delicious. Yeah. The tea for when I sick. Yes, it's very important for your health. Do you not uh, sick, uh, Brenda? Miel se dice honey, Jennifer. Thank you. <laughs> I, I need that to remember. I, sorry, I, I need that translate. <laughs> Um, yes, I All right. Okay, class, very good. So I heard some of your conversations, excellent. Very, very good. It's some, some vocabulary that might be useful. Um, for example, um, we pronounce this vitamins. Vitamins, not vitamins, but vitamins vitamins okay and this could also be this could be another another word that could be useful acetaminophen 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 but solo para para su su Conocimiento. If, for example, the United States, people don't really say acetaminophen. They call it mostly by the name of the most common acetaminophen, which is Tylenol. So they just talk about Tylenol. Tylenol. Yeah. Tylenol is the name of the most common acetaminophen. Okay. Oh. Uh, yo pensé que era una marca en específico. Yeah, it is. Tylenol, ah, is, okay. Tylenol es el nombre del acetaminofén más famoso. De hecho, creo que, ajá, o sea, que es como, sí, el más famoso, en el original. Is the name of the pharmaceutical? No, it's the name of the, of, um, of the, of the type como, of pill. It's como, como la acetaminophen MK, MK yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. So it's it's very common. People just call it Tylenol, okay? So everybody just says just Tylenol, Tylenol, okay? And it's medicine, medicine, okay? And 
And um, the other one is ibuprofen. Ibuprofen. Oh, ibuprofen. Sorry. Yeah, ibuprofen. 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 Okay. Ibuprofen. ibuprofen. Yes, ibuprofen. Uh, 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 Loratitin. 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 And um, the other ones is just allergy medication. You can just say allergy medication. I remember my mommy told me to, to take. Ay, se me fue el nombre. Es para el dolor de estómago. Es uno rosadito. I don't remember what you what was is your name. Oh yes. This is yeah, but we 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 pronounce it Pepto Bismol. Pepto Bismol. Yeah. In in US is very common. Yes. The type. Yes. Very. Yeah. Exactly. Pepto Bismol. Pepto Bismol. Oh, I. Ya me acabo de acordar de algo. Um. What does teacher what does? Okay, so in Spanish you say big, big bad peru. Big bad peru. <laughs> but it's not that's not the pronunciation, okay? Really? Okay. No, really? <laughs> no, don't go to the United States saying big bad peru. No le van a entender. Okay. Uh -huh. All right, so <laughs> it's you pronounce it Bix, Bix Bipo, Rob, Bix Bipo, Rapper, Ram, Bipo, Bipo, Bix Bipo, Rob, Bix Bipo, Rob, no, 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 Bix Bipo, Rob, Rob, Como Rap, Rob, Rob, really. <laughs> Really? It's very difficult the pronunciation. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I think it's, I think for me. Se lo voy a escribir como suena. Bix Bipo Rum. Rap. Rap. Como rubber, pero rap. Va. Así. Vix vapor wrap. Vapor wrap. Ah, Vix vapor wrap. Yeah. <laughs> is with is the same the Peter Rabbit. <laughs> so don't go saying uh, uh, Vix vapor wrap. No le van a entender nada. So it's Vix vapor wrap. Vix vapor wrap. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Okay, good, 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 okay. All right, um, what else was I hearing? Oh, okay, so also another word that could be very um, a very useful is talking about tea, right? So tea, like when you have like a cold or the flu. Um, also honey, honey. Yeah. Garlic, garlic, right? Onion, garlic. Ajo. onion, ajo. yeah, ajo. Ginseng, 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 ginseng. Oh, ginseng. Is the same thing? Yeah, it. it is El jengibre. Oh, ginger. Uh -huh. Ginger. Oh, ginger, ginger, and here. Ah. All time, I is not pronunciation. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, what? Yeah, no. This is ginger. Ginger is ginger is um 
Ay, ¿cómo se, se me ha ido el nombre? Jengibre. Jengibre. Yeah, jengibre is ginger. Ajá, es que, um, ok, voy a uh, speak in, in Spanish. Mm -hmm. I, I have a, uh, one box da, de una ustedes con jengibre y dicen ginseng, pero vienen de Asia. Uh -huh. uh, entonces, entonces, no sé si lo estoy pronunciando, pronunciando como ellos lo dicen o si estaba la palabra en inglés. Por eso le preguntaba, ¿cómo se dice ¿Se quince o se dice jengibre? Es... Y acabo de, 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 de como le dicen a uno, de desprogramar, o sea, me ha desconfigurado ahorita mi cerebro, porque estoy hablando también en asiático, estoy tratando de aprenderlo, y se me están trabando las, se me están cambiando las palabras. <ríe> La conexión me está fallando, teacher. Ah, <ríe> uh, ok. <ríe> I, I understand what you're um what you're trying to say. Um so um ginseng and ginger are two different things. Really? Yes. What? Eh, Why? Si no me equivoco son de la misma familia, pero diferente. Oh. Es, como, es como decir naranjas y toronjas. Oh. Ok. They are different, but they're from the same family. Ok, entonces ginseng es, es así se dice en inglés, igual, ginseng. Ginseng, yeah. Ok. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so any other questions? No. Okay. Okay. Right. Uh, is the same um, uh, with la limon? Um, lemon. Um, lemon. Lima. Lemon. Lemon. Yeah. Okay. So. Y lime. 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 <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Ah, yo ahorita voy a desbloquear. <laughs> no <laughs> nivel de inglés. <laughs> Ok, bye. Ahora sí se les va, hoy se va a explotar el, el cerebro porque le voy, a enseñar, le voy a enseñar algo. Lemons are yellow. Limón amarillo. Limes, limes are green. Ah, ah limón verde, lima verde. No. No. Lemons are the color yellow. Limes are the color green. O sea, el limón es de color amarillo y la lima de color verde. Yeah. Es que, este, bueno, yo practico mi inglés viendo series o hablando consigo misma en mi mente y a veces me pongo a leer cosas así de etiquetas. A veces me salen bueno. esos tipos de... de, de de, de frutas, lima, limón, un refresco de lima, limón, y yo, what the fuck do you say mm -hmm. in English? I, y digo so, yo, pero ¿cómo se dirá? Ok, um, so, so the thing is, in, in, in El Salvador, when you say limón, se refieren a un, una fruta, porque realmente es una fruta, una fruta verde. Sí, pequeña, redondita. Yes. That in English is called a lime. Is not a lemon. It's a lime. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I see that um, in, in, in watch videos. Mm -hmm. I, I, I see that the lemon in, in the U.S. Yes. is very exactly. big. Yeah. And that. With, In, with the alfabeto. Exactly. So, if you want to say, when you say lemon in English, no se están refiriendo al limón que ustedes conocen. It's yellow. And it's big. It's like, it's, it's 
it's um it's bigger than the lem than a limon in El Salvador. It's bigger. It's it's I would say like this big, okay, approximately. It's it's yellow and it it's not round. It's not round. It's more it's like oval. yeah, it's more oval, oval shape. So and, well, I, I think the um, white sand. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, sorry. Mide alrededor de cinco meses, around the, 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 the cinco centimeters. I don't know. Yo? I, I, I don't honestly don't know. But and the the, the skin is thicker. But les voy a poner un, un, una foto para que puedan ver. That's a lemon. This is a lemon. Okay. All right just so that you understand. So it's different. Lemons are yellow, limes are green. Okay? Sí, entonces en realidad, en realidad, cuando ustedes hacen limonada, in English, we do not call it lemonade. We call it limonade. It's limonade because it's made of green lime. Mm -hmm. oh <laughs> I know. I know. Yes. So something to think about. Okay. Lemonade is from yellow lemons. That's different. Okay, lemonade is from is from yellow lemons, not green. Okay, you the lemon, it, it's different. Uh, for example, lima, lemon, lemon, persico, Persian, Persian. Persian. Sorry, chicos, me, me, me desconecté un momentito. Eh, no le escuché muy bien. Ada, you had a question? I think it's loading now. Sorry, could you repeat? Perdón, chicos, es que mi conexión está inestable ahorita. That's where we can Okay. Um, all right. Sorry, Ada. You, what was your question? No question. Oh, you don't have a question. Okay. All right. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to continue, guys. Uh, please tell me if you can see my screen. Can you see yeah, my yes, can. yes, yes, yes. Perfect. Okay, I want you to listen and repeat after me. We're going to listen to this. Uh, we're going to read the conversation between Joan and Craig. So we have, hi, Craig. Hi, Craig. Hi, Craig. Hi, Craig. Hi, Craig. Hi, Craig. How are you? How are you? How are you? Not so good. Not, Not so good. good. Not so good. I have a terrible cold. I have, I have a terrible, terrible cold. Really? 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 That's too bad. That's too bad. That's too bad. You should be at home. You should be at home. In bed. In bed. In bed. In bed. In bed. It's really important. It's really important. really important to get a lot of rest. To get, to get, a, lot get a lot of rest. Of rest. 
And have you taken? Have taken? And have you taken? Have you taken? Taking anything for it? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Well, it's something useful to eat garlic soup. Well, well, it's helpful to eat garlic soup. Just chop up. Just, Just chop up a whole head of garlic. A whole head of garlic. And cook it in chicken stock. And cook chicken stock. Try it. Try it. It really works. It, it really works. Really works. Yuck. Yeah. Yeah. Yuck. Yuck. Yeah. Yeah. Yuck. That sounds awful. That, that sounds awful. That sounds awful. Good. Do you have any questions about the vocabulary? This means awful. Awful, awful. Yeah, it means horrible. Awful. It means horrible. Yeah, like like horrible. Like yeah, like awful, horrible, terrible. Okay. Disgusting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it could be disgusting too. Any other words? Awful. No. No. Okay. No. Stop. All yes. right. Very good. Okay. So what we're going to do here? Um, let's talk about the infinitive complement. What should you do for a cold? We can, when you say, what should you do? Uh, we can say, you should, remember we learned about should? Remember? Yeah, sure. You should. Yes. What's, you should, what does it mean you should? Yes. Debería. Do the videos, right? Uh -huh. Exactly. So th that is, we could say, what if, if I say, what should I do? What should I do? If I ask you this question, what should I do? I can answer, you should blah, 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 right? So that, that could be one way. But it's not the only way, okay? We can uh, also mention something else. We can say, for example, it's important, it's sometimes helpful, it's a good idea. Can you repeat after me? It's important. It's important. It's important. Mm -hmm. Important. It's some it's sometimes helpful. It's sometimes helpful. It's sometimes helpful. It's a good idea. It's a good it's idea. Yes. What do you? How do you say it's important? It's important. It's important. To take some vitamin. Yeah. For example, to get a lot of rest. It's sometimes helpful. How do you say that? It's sometimes helpful. How do you say that in Spanish? A veces sirve o a veces ayuda. A veces ayuda. For example, it's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. It's a good idea. What does it mean? It's a good idea. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. Yeah. To take some vitamin C. Okay. So you can use these. Now notice after using these, it's important and sometimes helpful. It's a good idea. We use to infinitive. To get, to eat, to take. Okay. Yes. 
Yes, Ana Marcela. In this case, may I say it's imperative or in, imperative? It's imperative. Um, you can, but it's not. Um, it's not common. It's too formal. You can if you want, but it's it's too formal. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So let's do this. Let's try to figure this one out. Look at the health problems and try to match them. Oops, sorry. Try to match the health problems here. Okay. So for example, match the problems with the advice. So for a sore throat, what, sorry, no, 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 sorry. For a huh? yeah, for a sore throat, what could you do for a sore throat from all of these advice? Take some vitamin C, put some ointment on it, drink lots of liquid, go to bed and rest, a put a heating pad on it, put it under cold water, take some aspirin, see a dentist, see a doctor, get some medicine. Do you understand the vocabulary? Yes. Okay. So right now I want you to match the problems with the advice. One is get some medicine. A cough. So do it individually. Yeah, I'm not really sad. Oh. Okay, we're going to check. Are you ready? Not yet. Not yet? Do you know? Not yet. Okay. No Bye. Oh, I'll wait for you. Okay, yeah. okay, let's check that. All right, so a sore throat. What can we do for a sore throat? Um, 
Let it be. Put some ointment on. Let, 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 let see. See. Let see. Yes. Good. Yes. Absolutely. Very good. A lot of drunk. Yes. Sorry? I think a letter A. Pick some vitamin C. Yes. To take some vitamin C. Mm. Could be. There's actually many possibilities. So we can have say letter A, letter C, anything else? No? Okay. All right, cough. What can you do for a cough? For a cough? And letter A. Letter A, okay. Anything else? Yeah, so letter J. 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 Yeah, letter J. Yeah, definitely. Okay. A backache. What could be what could you do for a backache? And the letter here. Spanda. Spanda. Letter what? Letter B. Letter B. Letter B, yes, okay. Letter D, letter D, yes. C. Letter C. Mm, for backache? No, I don't think so. Backache is dolor de espalda. Letter I. I see a doctor. Could be, if it's really bad, yeah. And also letter E, put a heating pad on it, right? Una comp eh, es como una eh, compresa uh, caliente, right? O una almoh uh, almohadilla caliente. Okay, a fever? Letter G and letter E. Letter G, okay. And letter E? Uh, letter C? You no. Know. Letter C? Yeah, letter C. Letter uh, letter C. Doctor? Yes, C a doctor. F. Letter F? No. Letter F, no. F. Put it under cold water, no. Put under cold water significa ponerlo debajo del agua helada. I would, I would say D. Right? Yeah, fever is fiebre, teacher. Is fiebre? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, in, in the hospital, when I have fever very high, mm -hmm. uh, put in... in under cold water. Sí, pero no va a decir ponerlo debajo del, porque la, porque tengo una fiebre. Póngalo debajo de, del agua cal, del agua helada. Ay, ¿Te acuerdas? Yes, no, porque no no podemos pon, tenemos que poner algo debajo del agua. Oh, okay. Entonces no, ¿qué, qué vamos a poner debajo la cabeza o what? right? It would be very difficult, right? Uh, the, the body. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but when it says put it, is referring to the fever, right? So no podemos poner la fiebre debajo del agua. Yeah, so I know what you mean. Maybe like to put like cold compress. Yeah, that that I understand. Okay. okay. Thank also, you. Also, letter J. Mm -hmm. Letter J two. A toothache. H. H. Letter H. Letter H. Letter H. H. Yes. Letter H. Anything else? Letter J. Maybe letter J. Uh -huh. Good. Okay. A bad headache. 
bad headache. Letter B. No, B, no. Letter D? Letter D, yes. Letter, letter D, definitely. G? Okay, good. Anything else? J, letter J. Letter J, yeah. I, too. Letter I, too. Sure, yeah. Yeah, very good. Okay. Excellent. A burn. A burn. Una quemadura. Letter B. Letter B. Yes. See a doctor. Yeah. Letter I. Oh, see Brenda. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> Letter F. Letter F. Oh, see. Oh, see. Yes. Anything else? No. Okay. C. Letter C, uh, Letter C. C? Being lots of lupus. Mm, probably C, no. Okay. The flu? Letter E. Letter E. Letter A. Letter E, no. Letter E, no. Letter A. A, okay, yes. Letter A. Letter E. B. Letter letter I maybe I A I, A. I yes I yes. not yeah because A. E is A, A. I uh -huh. letter, mm. letter C letter C it's important go to the arrest yes letter C letter D Okay. All right. Very good. And I would, yeah, that's it. Okay. Good. Very good. Bravo, guys. Excellent. Okay. All right, guys. Um, bye. Solo ahorita entonces lo que voy a hacer es de algo que se me escapó, la verdad, de todo. Hacerle el principio de la clase. Yes. Yes. I, yes. <laughs> Sorry. Estaba tan emocionada de verlos. It's me, teacher. It's me. <laughs> okay. All right. Ya solo de momentito mientras hablo ahí la, la, el documento. Ok, eh, empezamos. Ada Verónica. Present. Very good. Alexandra Jamilet García. Alexandra Jamilet García. No. Uh, Alicia Pérez Gavidia. Alicia Pérez Gavidia. Espera un momento. Present, ok. Bye. Perfect, thank you. Eh, Ana Maricela Flores. Excellent. Eh, Brenda Claribel Mejía. I'm not here. I'm here. Okay, good. Um, Cecilio, Cecilio, perdón, Cecilio Antonio Cortés. Ok, um, Eugenio Ernesto Martínez. Ada Verónica, please mute your microphone. Ok. Thank you. Um, Jacqueline Vanessa Quijada. Jacqueline Vanessa Quijada. Eh, Jennifer Nauset Arevalo. Present, Miss. Very good. Juan Antonio Bran. Present, teacher. Very good. Uh, Catherine Andreina Perez. Present, teacher. Great. Thank you. Catherine Giselle Bonilla. Present, teacher. Very good. Thank you. Eh, Catherine Maria Los Meléndez. Present, Miss. Yeah, thank you. Lenin Hernández Flores. Present, Miss. Excellent. Luis Alfredo Aguilar. Present, Miss. Excellent. Miguel Antonio Rodríguez. Present, Miss. Excellent. Uh, Nelson Eduardo Alparo. I hear me. 
Excellent. Noé Ezequiel Rivera. Noé Ezequiel Present, Rivera. Miss. Okay, thank you. Norma Lisa Crispin. Norma Lisa Crispin. Eh, Olivia Raquel Rodríguez. Present. Excellent. Eh, Oscar Alexander Domínguez. I'm here, teacher. Excellent. Reina Isabel Martínez. Reina Isabel Martínez. Zaira Idalia Oviedo. Sara Idalia, Idalia Oviedo. Y Silvia S. Rivera. Silvia S. Rivera. Vale, solo para confirmar, entonces no escuché a Alexandra Yamil Pérez. No, perdón, Alexandra Yamil García, sorry. Eh, Cecilio Antonio Cortés. Jacqueline Vanessa Quijada, Norma Lisset Crespin, um, Reina Isabel Martínez y Zaira Idalia Oviedo. No escuché a ninguno de ellos. Okay. okay, guys, thank you very much for... Uh, See you next Monday. Thank you for being in class. And uh, this week, only today, okay? We will see each other next week, okay? On Monday. All right, guys? So take care. Happy right. vacation. Take uh, care, teacher. Bye. Happy vacation. Take care, Happy everyone. Happy vacation, vacation, guys. See you Monday. See you Monday. See you next Monday. Bye-bye. Have a good night. Thank you, you too.